This edition of Mac Voices is supported by Casper. You can join me and so many others who sleep on an American-made Casper mattress by visiting casper.com slash macvoices. Order yours now and experience their combination of latex foam and memory foam for yourself in your own home for 100 days. And use the code MACVOICES to save $50 on the size that suits you. Hi, I'm Chuck Joyner. This is Mac Voices at WWDC and the Alt Conference in San Francisco. And I found Kelly Gumont in San Francisco. What What are you doing in San Francisco, Kelly? Well, you know, you get a certain number of Mac geeks together and, like, I feel compelled to arrive. Like, like we have our own center of gravity? Is that it? Yeah, it kind of is. There was, like, a disturbance in the force. In the force. And, yeah. In, in, in the force. Yes. Um, yeah. You, you aren't showing your Star Wars colors at all. <laughs> Seriously, uh, are you here for AltConf, or why are you here? Um, partially for AltConf, and then partially for the App Camp Party, which is happening tomorrow night uh, with James Dempsey and the Breakpoints, and we're doing a bunch of fundraising for that. So I came down to work to work on that as well. I saw Jean last night at another party, but I haven't had a chance to talk to her. Um, <laughs> but App Camp just rolls on. It seems to be opening new, new what do you call them, chapters or... Or uh, locations, camps. Okay, well, yeah, yeah camps. We just um, keep in expanding. <laughs> do you have any idea how many there are now? Uh, right now, uh, I don't remember the number off the top of my head, but I can tell you where they all are because there's Vancouver and Seattle. We do two sessions in Portland and uh, Vancouver, BC. And then uh, we do uh, this year, we've added Orange County and Phoenix, Arizona. And those are going to be very exciting. In fact, uh, David Sparks' wife is the organizer for the Orange County camp. So it's, it's, it's great. Yeah. It, it, it's grown so much since it started it really in Portland. It's, it's really impressive. And it's been impressive to see the community get behind it. Well, and the thing about it is that technically it started here because Gene came to WWDC a few years ago, was sitting in the room with everybody, and realized in a room of 5,000 people she couldn't see another woman from where she sat. And she decided to see what she could do to change that. And so now here we are. And having been to the first day and a half now of AltConf, um, it has changed a lot. In fact, I've been with one of the gentlemen here that letting people in, and we've been commenting on how many women there are that, that are here. And it's, I'm not going to pretend to know a percentage, but it's a lot more than it has been in the past. Yeah, it's very noticeable. Um, I, what, what my goal with it is, is to... Um, take away the advantage because they're used to always, you know, in life, there's usually a very long line for the ladies room. And that's one of the advantages to come into a tech conference is that's never a problem. <laughs> and I want to change that. So you, wait, wait, you want to change it so that it's less convenient? I do because I want it to be, because that's a sign of success. That's a uh, sign that it's like sort of equal because in a place where you get about 50, 50, the line for the ladies is always longer. And so that's, that's one of the things that, that I'm sort of hoping for. And my secret agenda is just that I was the only girl in a lot of ways as a kid. And I want to change that. I want that to be better. I want it to be easier. I want it to be cool. And I don't want it to be the hurdle that it is. And I don't want, I don't want anyone to have to go home and feel excluded and go home and feel beat down and go home and give up. Because there's absolutely no reason to. And that was one of the really amazing things about the keynote was the video at the end with all the different developers and all the different apps that they were building and all the different places they were using them. And to me, that was just terribly exciting to get to see. You know, when you're on the Mac Jury or Mac Voices, so often we're talking about a topic or a subject. We don't necessarily get to talk a lot about you. What do you consider yourself? Are you a developer? Or are you a journalist? Or are you a mixture of a little bit of everything or some stuff I don't know about? <laughs> well, I'm not a developer yet. Um, I do a lot of support and I do testing. So I enjoy breaking stuff. I'm aspiring to be a developer and App Camp has been a huge piece of that it, because I don't feel like I have to break in anymore. I feel like there's actually a path. And there's there's a way forward if I want to do this, even, you know, the way that I'm, you know, even in like, like, I'm not fresh out of school. I'm not, I, I don't have a newly minted computer science degree or anything like that. And I still feel like there's an opportunity for me in that respect. Uh, I'm a journalist. Um, a lot of what I do, I call cheerleading. So, um, you know, because you know as soon as we're done shooting this video that I'm going to go, okay, so I have this really amazing app I need to tell you about. A friend of mine built it, and it's awesome, and you totally need to know. And 
then you're going to tell me about like, have you seen this thing that I have on my watch now? And I'm going to go, oh, I just got to watch. That's awesome. And then, by the way, I just got to watch. And um, and then we're going to have that conversation. And then later, I'm going to be able to go, hey, Chuck recommended this app to me. You guys should check it out because you totally need it for the thing that you're doing. Mm-hmm. And so I do a lot of connecting sort of in that space as well. And, and uh, it's and I really enjoy it. So you're sort of the grease that uh, no, the grease that, that makes the wheels turn and holds things together. Yeah, you can say that. Okay, I, I like it. I like it. You do it so well. You do it so well. Um, I'm going to let you get in because I know you know you didn't come to San Francisco to talk to me, even though it's well, it's nice. It's a bonus. Okay, thank you. I like that. No, I mean, all, all conf is a bonus. I came to talk to you. Oh, oh I see. <laughs> and then there happens to be a conference just over there, so I can do that, too. Yeah. I We, we come and just hang out at the movie theaters <laughs> in the Metreon. Um, where can folks find you? Uh, you can find me on Twitter as Verso, and you can find me over uh, volunteering and filling out paperwork at appcampforgirls.com. And uh, you can occasionally find me over at the Mac Observer as well. Good to see you, Kelly. Thanks so much. Thank you. By the way, uh, nice. I, I said it before. Nice shirt. <laughs> you should see. The, I have uh, vans with Darth Vader on them. I'll, you, maybe I'll show them off later. <laughs> you're, you're incorrigible. <laughs> Folks, I'm Chuck Joyner. This is Mac Voices. We're at WWDC and the Alt Conference in San Francisco. Thanks for watching. <laughs> you brought it on yourself. I did. <laughs> Visit MacVoices.com for show notes, links to subscribe, and to connect with Chuck on Twitter, Google+, Facebook, YouTube, Vimeo, SoundCloud, the Mac Voices blog, the Mac Voices Dispatch, our weekly newsletter, and on Mac Voices Magazine, free on Flipboard that helps you do more with your Apple tech. Advertising handled by Backbeat Media at backbeatmedia.com. Bandwidth provided by Cashfly at cashfly.com. <laughs>